Hello and welcome back. This is Really Big Hat, and I'm Jared, and this is our part two of our Let's Play Humankind series. So, last we left off, I was marching these guys towards this uh, independent people, I believe. I was thinking about getting an army up here to use my expansionist ability. Oh, and there they come. Yep. Don't even give me time to explain what I'm doing. Oh well. As I was saying, I was bringing these guys up this way to A, take out this independent people so that they stop spinning out hostile armies, and B, try and steal this from the, what are they now? Still the Mycenaeans. Okay. With five farmers quarters. This one and there's those achievements again. Like I said, every time I boot up, it's not weird or annoying at all. <laughs> you know what? Looking at this, I could probably take this. But why bank on probably when I can just wait four turns? Okay. Let's see here. Got quite a few things available, actually. None of my yields are really super great here either. This should be pretty effective here. As well. Now, is there something that I want to stretch towards? Uh... Maybe up here. Maybe up here, towards these strategics. And down here I can also get one. Don't know if there's anything I need to stretch towards down here, though. Doesn't appear to be. So I'll just go... Mm, I'll try not to block that off, so I'll just kind of go over here somewhere. And I do want to get those online there, since, you know, I'm getting the bonus for it being a victorious city. And you guys, head that way for me, please. Okay, now what do I need to rush towards here? Anything? Really? Um, attach outpost cheaper, that's good. I could get some bonuses in there, but none of my cities are really up to that right now. I do have horses now. I only have one horse, so I can't train horsemen yet, but I do want to get in that range. And I'll go ahead and get the army size down there before I finally come back to Imperial Power. If one of these comes up before that, I can always change out. But that's the path I'm thinking. Expand. Gonna take four turns. Okay, over here. Still not doing great on food. And I do still have... 
my old emblematic district district with uh, farmer quarter adjacency to utilize. So I shall do so. I'm gonna get a couple of those over here. Actually, I think one over there, and then hmm, maybe this one right here. Yeah, and that should be enough for now before I want to finally move on to, yeah, maybe grab animal barns, grab industry off the river, and then we'll see where I'm sitting. Okay, one turn out up there. And... Let's see here. I'm gonna try and get towards this for some market quarters. Drum roll, please. Yep, there it is. Go and attach this up. And there's already one of my stars. Alright, now you guys head back this way and join the siege. Which I will go ahead and assault and instantly resolve. Perfect. Flawless victory. Now, as for this city, it's got a lot of districts along here. Yeah, getting rid of those. <laughs> Doesn't let me build this for stability. That's interesting. I wasn't going to anyway. I was gonna start on the obelisk. Probably... Probably out here somewhere. There it looks good. And then I was gonna burn that city to the ground next turn and turn it into an outpost. Because I'm over the city cap right now and I don't wanna be. Now you guys, head down this way for me. Okay, um... You know what? I could actually use some movement speed. So I will take that. A first ransack. See the okay. sights. Appreciate the first ransack culture, of the take anything that's save not session. Down. Sure. Okay. And then just plop that down. Let's see, you've got. Yeah, it does look like this is pretty much the best spot anyway. And it can be attached to the capital or up here. I think I might actually take it here. That is going to tank the stability in here, but it should be getting better and it ought to level out before long. At the very least, I'm working on a triumphal arch, which will help, short term. Then I gotta get down here. I gots to. Scientist star. Always nice. And you guys can hold position there. I will take extra science. And 
I will upgrade to some Praetorian Guards, because they real good. So I should be able to take them out in relatively short order. What's my war score like right now? Your 72. And it's improving three per turn. Alright. Don't have any extra grievances to throw. I could refuse his demands. Don't need to do that, though. Oh. Here's a, another dang... Bunch of warriors, huh? Well, you know what? I'm gonna come team these guys up so that they don't get ambushed separately. Oh, it looks like they're going to bother them. Well, that's fine. Oh, nope, they're coming to bother me. That's not fine. Hmm. Looks like this is really the only way through. And they have left it graciously open. Okay. Just gonna leave the Praetorian Guards to handle this. And I technically won. I guess they ran off somewhere. to grant adjacency, so I'll go ahead and build two. Okay, stability. I'll take the stability. It's... I need it. I def definitely need it. In fact, I'll take another Triumphal Arch, if you please. Uh, down here looks good. Can get closer to those horses, maybe get some science districts out there. And let's see. Nowhere else really needs stretched towards, so far as I can tell. But I would like another one of these. So how about right here. I'll only lose one food. Ugh. And it's not letting me work on those, even though they technically grant stability. That's upsetting. 
Well, I'll plant a garrison down here. Aha! I win. Icons rides a horse. Got siege tactics, that's good. I think that gets me up to, yeah, it does get me up to a six person army. So, I will actually come join these guys together. And then... Hmm, I think it's probably time to declare war. I think I'm pretty good on assault too. And everybody else defend. All right. He did bring somebody up there, but other than that, he's rolling over for me. Yeah, the Romans getting their unique unit even earlier makes them a lot more relevant. And they were already pretty relevant, in my opinion, anyway. Everybody's got their own take, but I like the Romans. They got an interesting play style. Hmm. I'm gonna go and pop him over there. Bring his friend over. the flag. Yep. And that's mine. Does he have any units that I can see? No, but there is another hostile army out there. And that does look like that was the war. Yep. And it's already given me the cities. Because I claimed them with demands. Okay, now you guys, come get them, please. that it'll matter much. gonna go and say no to this. As long as he doesn't have a unit floating around somewhere, he should be gone next turn. Okay. What do I want this city to work on? Go and get some of the better basic infrastructure for me. Because I am gonna go ahead and keep this city as well. That only puts me one over the cap. 
Yep, there he goes. Mice and the Ants have fallen. <laughs> Quite appropriately to the Roman Empire. I guess I gotta watch out for the Huns. Okay, now I gotta march this way. Because I just cannot leave that. Nope, can't do it. These guys, oh, I can actually just absorb. Ooh. Well, in that case, you have I'll do added that thing. an independent people to your empire. And there's those well, achievements that pop up every time I do this. Also, not annoying. Okay. Yeah, I'll keep that there. I'm coming for you. However you pronounce that city. Urquez? Guess that's it. Okay, and I've got... a tenet. I might go for the science here. Yeah, I will. I'm going for the science. And I'll leave it there. Uh, well, I don't know. Maybe I want to be funny and give the Romans... <laughs> Technically not inaccurate, I guess. I mean, again, this is all just for flavor, so it's not like it matters much, but... Eh. Maybe I'll change it again later. The first ransack. I wouldn't call it elegant, but it may teach them to keep their doors locked. That's got to be my tenth first ransack. Okay. Do I need to touch this right now? I guess I'll go ahead and do that. Let's hope that there is enough innovation and motivation to counteract I've got a few the things. Long hours. Few they things say to connect here. alloys are stronger than pure metal. I guess we're going to see how far that metaphor applies to human society. Oh, I probably could have done this. Oh, well. Look at me. I suppose there are some things that are best done alone. Okay, now technology. I want to just back up and grab all of this, basically. Those are the two big ones. Then I'll pick these up. And then I might want to consider just going to the next stage already. How many... Okay, I'm still working on a couple triumphal arches. I kind of want to get them up. Your people see it as a place of safety and a symbol of power. Only your friends know of the extensive wine cellar. Begin the siege here. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... Yeah, didn't even lose anybody. Okay... I go ahead and attach that here, and I'll do the same with this one when I get to it. Maybe. Again, I can afford to be one over the cap. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna burn it. Well, actually, it's got a lot of infrastructure. Well, you you still retain that. 
Ooh. Don't mind if I do. And I see somebody down here that needs introductions. Oh my gosh, I did it again. I really hate that. I really hate that. split these probably between here and the capital Last I checked, this was going towards 100. Wow, I guess attaching that one thing really did a number on it. Well, in that case, I'll buy that out and get to work on, I guess, one of these. Plop it down there. And then I'll see about Commons Quarters. Got a few good spots. I think I like right here, since I definitely want science there. So, will this independent people yeah. be an ally or an enemy, a barrier or a blessing? Their future may not be in their hands. It certainly isn't. Okay, and I definitely don't want to keep this, but I also can't really attach it here just yet. So, I think I am just going to ransack it and leave it as an outpost for now. And you guys... Oh, somebody else already took it. Wow in the one turn since I was just, just about to send somebody. Isn't that just how that goes? Okay, uh, well, in the meantime, you can help with that. Incredible. Ten territories pulled together into a single megalopolis. The next time uh, is he to does come a lot up of stuff like this too, saying things have happened that haven't happened. that yeah I guess this is a fine spot I can go ahead and buy a dock you have built a first harbor to construct and launch the vessels of the Empire time to stock up on champagne bottles maybe see what the trains like over there hmm Maybe I could have kept this as its own city and started building across that way. Well, I didn't really know there was a that way, so... How are you guys doing? Really? Really?
Executing your first ransack is not very friendly, but it's better to be the ransacker than the ransackee. Again, that's like my 11th first ransack. Well, there's something to be said for unswerving dedication to a cause. Duh. See, I had that thought in my head. I was like, I don't need to worry about the wonder because I'm founding outposts and I need the influence for that. But then I forgot about that half of the thought and I went back to check on the wonder. Starvation? I don't mean to nag, uh, but the marks one leaves on history should not necessarily be from malnutrition. Yeah, let's get that online. this online, I guess. And see what we can do about those triumphal arches. Come on. We have our orders. Fascinating, the Persians. They probably just stopped over to say hello. And build a palace or two. This is where... Greetings, Sovereign. Do you too believe that I have something here that should please us both? There is much to admire here. Accepted. Like moonlight on water. The world comes a bit closer together, thanks to the first trade link that will bring shiny baubles and greedy vendors. Reaching the end of an ideology axis isn't extremist. Think of it as being focused, yes? Very goal-oriented. With 15 farmers' quarters, you'll soon be needing another 15 quarters just for food storage. Permanent settlement on another continent. There we are. Quite the globe spanning imperialist you've become. Now, how much is it going to be? 1800 for that one. Is it going to be different? Okay, no. In that case, I will start here and then connect that. And maybe I'll go look at those. should listen to this. Accepted. With pleasure. Tremendous! Tremendous! I will purchase all the stability. Thank you. Now how are we looking? Yeah, that's what I thought. And I do want to get this obelisk finished. And 
I guess you guys can just hang out there. Pretty central location. Up. Oh. Got some rebels. Okay. That's interesting. Okay. I guess they wanted to attack me and they hid in the water. That's weird. It's not like I've been wasting too much time here. All in. Blades in the water. Hmm. Okay. Oh, come on. I met the whole army. Now you guys. I guess you can also hop out of the water and attack. Maybe. Yep. I'll just have to resolve that. Now I've dealt with them. I've got this finally back online and working. Still use some food. Oh, well, got a lot of spots for these. Starvation? I'm afraid they've already eaten all the bread and the cake, and now the pantry seems empty. Wow, that 
but it's really getting annoying. Now it's 18. Ugh. I'd rather do this. And that. And I guess I'll just keep the one. Grab an iron mine. And... Oh, hey! I got some stuff down here. Don't mind if I do. the rest of these. No. Oh, got plenty in here. Look at this. Nice. Okay, with that, I think I'm going to go ahead and go to the medieval era. But as whom? Aztecs are taken. struggling with food and stability so the English sound good I'm gonna go with the English wisdom and whatever you think of the agrarian English don't complain about their cooking they'll come after you with their long bowmen and okay I believe we will call that an episode I have conquered an entire continent, so that's a good start. I am out to a commanding lead, as could be expected from this. But, you know, we can still see how things progress from here. But we will do that next time. Later. <laughs>